one way to get yourself quickly to hell is disrespecting our very own doctor of gospel. Yeah? Who disrespects Mam Rebecca Malop? No, I really want to know. Before we get into it, guys, I have Tiffany, who is a twin mom, and she is married to a man in the army. Oh my goodness, that must be a lot of moving. She is currently in Japan, and she wants to share her experiences with us, from vlogs, to fashion hauls, to everything in between, while raising twins. Superwoman. Tiffany. Hi everyone, my name is Tiffany, I'm a twin mom, I'm an American Navy wife, currently living in Japan and I'm just here to share my experience on how it feels to live abroad, raising twins, being a wife, being a mom and I create vlogs, lifestyle, um, fashion, you name it, I do everything, okay? So please just subscribe to my channel, please, and I'll catch you guys on my channel. I am Sims and it's at the right Sims on Instagram. So please, uh, your sister. Who ordered the Azul? Yeah, I'm wearing the Azul dress. Anyway, guys, please don't forget to subscribe to Tiffany's channel, okay? I bow, guys, not the disrespect Dr. Rebecca Malope received on Saturday, okay? So on Saturday, there was a live recording of Obusi. Obusi, the gospel singer, guys. The one that's married to that man that I don't like very much because he, he seems like he's got very much controlling tendencies. Utapelo. Utapelo. Anyway, guys. So, old Dr. Rebecca Malope was invited as one of the guest artists, right? So, someone who was there at the show, because before we got to find out what really happened, Dr. Rebecca Malope came out on Twitter and told us, Guti, may we please put her in our prayers because she has never been so disrespected in her life. Like in her music career, she has never felt so disrespected. She thought she would be fine. But her spirit is just not agreeing. Like, she's not okay. So she'd like us to put her in our prayers, you know? And of course, we're obliged. I mean, this is the doctor of gospel. What she says, you must do, you know? Hey, Nami, Yimi, loyal. Sing your tanda, Zalapaya, I'm praying. Ooh, doctor, Rebecca, can you please her heart? Kupa umuluko lepi. Like, make her heart fine. Oh, please, may she be okay. And then we finally get to find out what we were praying for. So someone that was at the show said that Dr. Rebecca Malope did not deserve the treatment she got for a person of her caliber, for an artist of her stature. You understand that? Oh, Dr. Rebecca, she was about to go on the stage with Ubusi, but then there were changes that were made a few minutes before she got on stage. So when she was asking questions, Busi's manager, who also happens to be her husband, told Rebecca Malop she can F off. I'm a daughter, eh, no? Your boyfriends and your husbands. Anyway, so old Dr. Rebecca was told to F off, but oh no, she didn't. She didn't F off. Instead, she got on the stage like the professional singer that she is, like the professional superstar that she is, she got on that stage, she sang her heart out, she sang, she hit the vocals, she hit the high notes, she hit the down notes, she hit the side notes, she hit the left notes, she hit the right notes, and then dropped the mic and left. Hmm, that is someone of a right stage, now I understand. Okay, fine. But you know what sucks is that after that whole incident, even after Dr. Rebecca Malopa came out and told us oh, she's not fine and she's never been so disrespected in her life, no one from Busi's camp thought to call Dr. Rebecca or apologize to her. Still no apologies. That is so wrong, you know. Even for Busi to find out, Uti, Mama, how are you? How, how did you go? What's wrong? What happened, you know? Yes, your, your husband is your manager. But baby girl, that man is going to burn your breeches. That man is going to burn your bridges and your talent. Pela, you, you are very talented, Busi. You are talented and then even your prophecy. Pela, Busi, you, you know, Busi, she, 
She's the lady that when she sings in between her songs, she'll tell you about the prophecies. She was told she 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 went to heaven, she came back, she sat on the golden chairs. Yeah, now she was told by the angels to bring her passport. She knows what's going on in heaven. Allegedly, apparently. Ah it's not me, it's her, you know. But her husband, that man is very questionable. That man has very dodged tendencies. Utapelo. Even on his Facebook. He was like, you made me so proud on Saturday. Yeah, you never questioned my choice of music, my choice of your outfits, my choice of how to, to sing, my choice of what, what. Who, can, can, who is singing on the stage? Is it not Busi? Who is the one that is talentious? Is it not Busi? But the husband seems to be like the one in charge, in control. Eh, Busi. Put yourself first, queen. That man is going to burn your bridges. That one, I, I, we can foresee. Already, Jay, you left a sour taste in, in Rebecca's mouth. And it's very hard to do that. Jolani, guys. Yes, Jolani. As namona. As namona. We are not jealous. We are jealous less. Ki, ki, marry these people that want to ruin your careers. Imagine all this hard work and so much talent. Now it's going to go to the trenches. Because uh, your, your husband thinks they can tell Rebecca where to get off, where to get down. Sibiti. That audacity. I don't think even wallets can sell that type of audacity. Anyway, guys, let's talk more in the comment section down below. Pussy. Hi. Mkuze. Kuze. Mbambe. Bambe.